Hello, this is Hedy Borzu and welcome to SirianTooth.com. In this tutorial, I'm going to teach you how to connect a BVH file or a motion capture to a 3D model. So let's get started. Go to the project file and download it. There are two files there. Drag them here one by one. And create a new layer for each. Go to the channel box here and select your 3D model and create a new layer here and call it model, save it, uh, select your BVH and create a new layer for your BVH file and call it BVH. Let's turn this layer, your BVH layer off work only on your model layer so go to rigging here go to a skeleton and click on human IK create a new skeleton here and call it model scale it up a little bit by holding down the control on the keyboard and left mouse button and drag it here Now, go to the front view here and go to shading and activate the x-ray joints. Click here, hit W on the keyboard and move it up. Hit E on the keyboard to rotate it and put it here. And hit W again and let it to go further. and uh, click here hold down d on the keyboard to move only the pivot hold down d and for this one put it here go to the top view and go to the shading here and activate the x-ray joints hit w and hold down d on the keyboard and put it here put this one here and Put this one here, click here and put it here, hit E on the keyboard to rotate it, hit W to move it and E to rotate it, W and E, W and E, W and E. Hold down the D on the keyboard, click here, hit W and then hold down D and put it here. Put this one here by holding down the D on the keyboard and put this one here. Click here, put it here, put this one here and this one, put it here, put this one here. This one, put it here, and put this one here. You don't need to do all of these for the other side. You can mirror it for the other side. Now I'm going to show you how to do that. As you see, we did it only for one side. So mirror it from here, and you can see the result. Go to the perspective view and check it out. Not bad. Now go to the front view here and work on the legs. Click here, hold down D on the keyboard and put it here. Put this one here. And put this one here by holding down D on the keyboard to move only the pivot. Uh, go to the perspective view and select this one. Go to the side view. Sh go to the shading and activate the x-ray joints. Hit W on the keyboard and hold down D and put it here. Put this one here. 
and put this one here and mirror it now it's time to work on the spine so click here and put it here sorry click here hold down D and put it here click here hold down D and put it here not that much up click here put it here go to the perspective view and go to the shading activate the x-ray joints click here hold on D on the keyboard and put it here uh, move it up put it somewhere around here and click here and put it here and here we go it's time to connect these joints to the model mesh so click here first then click to your model mesh and go to the skin bind the skin edit reset setting and apply it now go to the definition some colors are not green and we should let all the colors to turn to green so to fix this issue click here hit e on the keyboard and rotate it a little bit this issue has been fixed in this side and for this side this issue also have been fixed so uh, go to the channel box and turn this layer off and turn this one on oh i forgot to do something click on the joints here and click here add selected object now everything's have been hidden so uh, go to the human IK and definition and create a new definition and call it BBH hit OK now I am going to connect this one to these joints so to do that uh, your BBH joints should be in T pose so go to zero frame and it is now on T pose so uh, click here double click here and connect it to this one double click one click double click one click double click one click and for the legs double click one click double click one click double click one click go here double click one click and for the hip two other joints are connected to the hip and it is so difficult to select the hip from here so go to the windows outliner the skeleton and uh, here is your hip so double click here and connect it to here double click here connect it to here go here double click here and connect it to here double click here connect it to here and for the neck double click here connect it to here double click here connect it to here double click here and connect it to here and that's it uh, go to character and set it to model 01 and for the source set it to bbh go to the channel box and turn both layers on and set it to 515 and let's see the results awesome go to show and turn off the joints and that's it thank you so much for watching this video